Pride Month in Fernadina Beach, the first ever parade and festival celebrating the LGBTQ community there. Hundreds showing up across Nassau County. News for Jack's reporter Zach Lashaway covered the celebration stretching from Central Park through downtown. It only took us 50 years. Fernandina Beach Mayor Johnny Miller. You know, I want to use words like I'm amazed, but I'm not. I'm not surprised at all. Welcoming hundreds of people to the first ever Fernandina Beach Pride Parade and Festival. I have never been prouder than I am of my community than I have been today. I love you all, and I love that you can love whoever the hell you want in my city. Bless your heart. Speaker. We are all the same. After speaker. People from all walks of life throughout Northeast Florida came together to celebrate Pride with little to no opposition in sight. The big hit at this Pride Festival is this two-year-old Great Dane named Gouda. What's up, buddy? He's celebrating Pride. It's pet hair dye. This inaugural Pride Festival was sparked after the mayor flew a Pride flag outside City Hall in 2018. So it all started a year ago with this piece of cloth right here. Causing controversy. The flag eventually came down, but the community came together to form this year's Pride Festival. This comes as a human rights ordinance moves through City Hall. A second reading of the ordinance, which would prohibit discriminatory conduct in employment and housing based on race, religion, gender, disability, and sexual orientation, passed unanimously. There will be a final reading on the ordinance in July. In Fernandina Beach, Zach Lajway, Channel 4, the local station. And we have even more stories covering Fernandina Beach, Hilliard, and Yuli. Be sure to join our dedicated Nassau County Facebook page. All you have to do is go to Facebook, search News for Nassau County.